Spencer Lazara, MMA Interviews. I'm alongside Mr. Jesse Taylor. Just got some rounds in here at Team Quest. Luckily, I didn't have to go on with this beast right here. He's got a big fight coming up against Kendall Grove over there in Perth, Australia. That's like your uh, your home uh, place to fight now, huh? Yeah, home away from home. Uh, it's a uh, fifth or sixth time. I don't even know, but I uh, fought there quite a bit. So got some fans down there. I'm excited to go back and represent. So is this fight at 85 then? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I played around with 70s for a little bit, and I kind of found my calling. Went back to 85s this past year and uh, doing pretty well, but uh, it's all in the past. It's got one fight at a time, and uh, I like, uh, I I'm back at 185s. Do you feel a lot stronger without extra weight on? I, I feel stronger. I have a good time during the training camp. I'm not thinking about my weight. Also, what I've noticed, when I'm cutting all that weight, I get injured more. And, you know, knock on wood, but I get, uh, I get no 85s. I, I'm pretty injury free and uh, pretty durable. How do you feel like this matchup plays out? Clearly, you have the wrestling advantage. Kendall's a pretty slick guy, good jiu-jitsu on the ground, good stand-up. You know, um, Kendall's tough, but uh, I'm confident these days, and I really feel I could beat him in all areas. Um, going there strong, and I'm, I'm going to bring the fight. I, you know, everyone know I want to bring the fight right away, and uh, I want to stay smart. That's what I've learned to do. Stay smart during the fight and, and get my hand raised. What are your goals moving forward? Do you feel like... Australia is a happy place for you to continue fighting, or do you really want to prove yourself in a fight like this against another ex-UFC guy and, and, and get back into the big show, get noticed? Exactly, I want to prove myself. It's, I, it's almost like I've been fighting an uphill battle, can't really catch a break. I beat some big names in the past and still haven't got the call. Um, there's Bellator, of course, out there, but uh, with me, it would be bittersweet to get back in the UFC, and uh, I want to go out there, make a statement here, and um, go back to the UFC. You know, I picked up a couple belts this last year, uh, they can't keep denying me, and I hope Joe Silva and UFC, if they see this, they, they give me another shot after this win. Do you, like, your only loss, correct me if I'm wrong, was to Hector? What, what other losses have you had uh, in the last couple of years? Yeah, I lost to a Hector. I also lost to this, this guy, this Polish guy. His name's uh, Mohamed Kolidov. He's a tough guy, a KSW champion guy. Um, but except those two, uh, yeah, all, all wins. Um, and again, that's why I'm kind of good taking this fight. They're like, oh, it's risky, but at the same time, I need a big name, I gotta make a statement. And uh, I really just wanna get back in the UFC when I enter my prime years here. How can we watch that fight? Is there is an online stream at all, or? Uh, this one really is hard, because uh, I fought down there before. They do film it, hopefully they get a good job of getting it out there, but uh, I'll be sure to put it up after the fight, if not, um, if it doesn't get out there live. Okay, and it's February 16th. When do you take off over there, get acclimated to the, uh, the, the change in day and just the time? Yeah, yeah, it's February 23rd is the fight. Um, but I leave Australia. I don't feel jet lag too much. Get out there the 18th, 19th. Enjoy the great city of Perth, Australia. And uh, um, the show's called Chaos. I'm the, the current Chaos middleweight champ, um, uh, February 23rd. And uh, yeah, it's uh, ready to go, though, against Kendall Grove. Yeah, I got a lot of killers here, definitely all getting ready. Anything else you want to say? Anybody you want to thank or whatnot? Yeah, I, I think I always want to thank, I want to thank uh, my training partners. I got to give you guys a shout out because it helps to have media on your side. I've learned uh, if media backs you up and you're winning, uh, UFC takes notice. So I want to thank the, the media out there that has supported me and hasn't uh, kind of give up on me. So I want to thank uh, you guys. <laughs> definitely best of luck in that fight there, Jesse. Look forward to seeing it. This man taking on Kendall Grove out there in Perth, Australia. I'm Spencer Lazara. You're watching MMA Interviews.